All right, y'all, what is up? Like I said earlier, well, in the vlog that y'all will see tomorrow, which I guess is today, I don't know, I, my mind's not in the right place right now. Anyway, I'm doing probably two videos a day all week, give or take, because I'm gonna be busy. But, today we're gonna do a uh, dip review and just talk about some shit, you know, friggin' just what we always do when I review dip. We fucking put a dip in, I give you my first thoughts, and then we talk about nothing, and then I freaking give you my final thoughts after letting it juice, and we're fucking on our way, you know? Alright, today's dip that we're going to be reviewing is Timberwolf Wintergreen Long Cut. Uh, it says New Darker Blend. I don't know how new that is, but whatever, I mean, we'll find out how good it is, and that's what fucking counts on this channel. My wife's looking at me. What's up, babe? Nothing, she said nothing. Alright, anyway, so, uh, it's cracked a can. Friggin' all plastic, and, of course, with the plastic cans, if you don't have really long fingernails, which I don't, because I just cut mine recently, barely have a friggin', I forgot to keep my, my, uh, what, what, what do I call it? I forgot. Oh, can cutter on my friggin' index finger, but whatevs. Anyway, if y'all never seen me crack a can, it's just... I'm assuming that's how everybody does it. I don't know. A lot, I, actually, that's not true. I've seen people take their thumb and do it like that. I've seen, like, all four fingers and roll it around like that. And then I've even seen people take, like, necklaces and stuff. My daughter's crying. Are you checking on her? Babe. Oh, okay. All right, anyway. So, now that we cracked the can, we got to pack it. Oh, yeah. This. I love that sound. I love packing cans. Remember, I was like... I don't even know. I was probably like, what the hell? Anyway, I was like, I don't know, freaking 13 in like sixth grade, and my buddies were all like big in a dipping at this point. No, I was probably 14. I don't know what grade I was in, but I was like 14, 13, 14. And they'd always be like, dude, listen to this. We'd be in school and they'd be like, yeah, I'm so cool. And I'd be like, shit, why did, why did I smoke? I can't. I could do this with cigarettes, you know, because I was a smoker. <laughs> Smoking. But uh, anyway, pack a can. And, uh, that smells shitty. That is shitty. Wow. Y'all should smell, smell that. I know you can't smell it. I'm just fucking with you. Anyway. Whew. I don't know. I don't like that smell at all. Uh, the cut. I gotta get out of the light. As y'all can see, it is actually really, like, really dark. The light kind of shines on it makes it not as dark. But, uh, the cut is very similar to, uh, I guess, uh, it reminds me of something. I want to say, I want to say like a, a drier grizzly is what it reminds me of. So, uh, you know, friggin', we'll see how it tastes. I think I paid, sorry, my hair is, I need a haircut. I keep, I haven't gotten like two and a half weeks. Anyway, I'm pretty sure it was like two something, like just over $2 for a can. But, uh, anyway, we packed our dip. Time to dip. I'm gonna put a freaking dip ski in that lip ski. You know what I'm saying? Um, sorry, I'm pretty hyper tonight. I don't know why. Um, pinchability. It's fairly easy to pinch, but it's not very stringy. So, we'll see if I need a, a little killer filler. I don't know. But, uh, no, same side as always. Mmm. Oh my god, that is just not good. We gotta spit our spit. No words, Coke Junkie. Blazing Nation's Mud Jug. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Blazing Nation's Mud Jug. Oh gosh. I got a real small one in, and it is not good. This is definitely getting dumped out after this video. All right, I'm gonna put a little more in because I don't have a big enough pinch to judge it yet. I don't have a normal size pinch, so I'll put a little bit more in. Just uh, scrape the bottom of the can. It's I don't like it so far. The taste is not very good. Just a little killer filler in there. 
So that way y'all can't be like, you didn't take a big enough pinch to, to judge it. Just a little, little killer filler. All right, so, oh, I don't like it. That is. All right, so, anyway, I don't like it so far. We'll see if it gets better. At first, first, uh, first taste, it's really not good. It's not sweet at all. Like, most wintergreens are kind of have a sweet flavor to it. This does not. This does not have a sweet flavor to it at all. It's very dry. Um, it's already falling apart, but we'll let it soak, ladies and gentlemen, and we'll freaking see what it tastes like in about, looking at my watch, about five minutes, so. Anyway, get a drink if you need one. I am making a video on how to drink with a dip in tomorrow. We'll do that, we'll do that tomorrow. Um, I don't know. Maybe tomorrow we'll see. I got a lot going on the next couple days. And then I'll just be relaxing again. So, I don't know. We'll see when I make the video. But, uh, yeah, I need a drink. I had that Coors Light because it was like 13 bucks for a 24 case at Walmart. So, I was like, hop on that deal. Uh, as you all can see, the dip wall is doing good. Doing real good back there. See if I can zoom in for you. Got a few more cans added to it since last time. I had to put a monster can up there just because I forget what it's even called. Sorry, it's going to be real shaky. Ultra Black. I really, really, really like that one. So I put it on there. I'm trying to zoom out. There we go. There we freaking go, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway, so... What did I do this weekend? I bought Dying Light. Uh, my buddy stopped by. I think, I think it was the day my Wi-Fi that I changed my Wi-Fi. But he stopped by because he just moved in about 30 minutes away. But he needed a place to stay for the night before he could move into his apartment the next day. So him and his family stayed here. Um, friggin, I got Dying Light that day. Dying Light is a great Xbox. I don't know if it's for PS4, I'm assuming it is, but it's a great game so far. I'm kind of pissed. If y'all decide to get it, if you're playing and you get pissed off and shut your Xbox off, make sure you exit to or, yeah, exit to main menu first, because I didn't, and it reset all my levels back to one, so I was still at the same spot, but I lost everything in my inventory, all my skill points and everything, so it was basically like restarting at a more advanced part of the game. Make sure It pissed me right off. I had to restart again so I could freaking get back to where I was. Mm -mm. This stuff is not good. It's it's everywhere. Mm. Oh. Well, I can tell you now, movability is not there. That literally, like, half of it just broke off and started coming out of my mouth, which is what I showed y'all. Mm -mm. Spit's pretty dark, though. The flavor is like, it's getting a little bit better, but of course, pretty much any can you buy that's straight plastic is going to taste, I don't know what the difference is between having a tin lid and a plastic lid, but every time we got the plastic, I get a plastic lid can, it just tastes like plastic to me. I don't know if it's like a mindset or what, but it's not good. It's not good. So we'll finish up the review because I want to take this shit out. Oh, that's bad. Um... It's it's kind of rough on the gums, but it's not like wintergreen. Like I don't know how everybody else is, but sometimes when I put a Copenhagen wintergreen dip in, it burns still, even though I've been dipping it for freaking months now. It's still like it's got that burning sensation to it, which is good. I like that, and it lasts a few minutes, then it goes away. This it's got a little burn, but it's not like a Copenhagen or not like a, a you know the wintergreen burn that you get. It's more of like a if you put in, uh, I can't even think of a dip, it's just dry. Um, I guess, I guess you'd say Grizzly Fine Cut, but I like Grizzly Fine Cut, but it is rough on the gums, so, yeah, anyway, it's like, it burns because it's dry, it's like it's cutting my gum a little, or my lip a little bit. Oh, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, friggin', I know I've been looking at my, 
I got the screen next to it. I got the camcorder now. So I keep looking at myself, just to make sure I'm in focus, but I should be looking at y'all. Getting right up in your faces. Anyway, so it's very dry. Uh, generating a normal amount, of, normal amount of saliva. It tastes like shit. It tastes worse than freaking kayak. It should be priced at like 89 cents a can. Timberwolf, y'all aren't doing it right because I paid $2 and some change for this and it's not worth that much. Uh, it's just not. The can itself, like, as far as like appealing, it's not appealing. Like, oh cool, a little wolf that you can barely freaking tell is a wolf unless you're right next to it. It looks more of like a shadowy figure. But, you know, from a distance, it doesn't look good. Uh, it's it's not that great. It, it's definitely on a scale of 1 to 10, like I always rate my dips, I'm going to give it a 3. I'll give it a 3. I could dip it if it was the last dip on earth, but I might quit after a couple weeks because this is just, it's not good at all, y'all. Um, if y'all like this, let me know in the comments. Or if you haven't had it, let me know in the comments if you would buy it based on my review because I, I say you shouldn't. But, you know, some people are like, oh, I want to see because whatever. I don't recommend buying it. It's not worth your money. I, I would rather dip, like, Skull friggin', I don't even know, cough syrup cherry or something, which I hate that, too. I got to dip. Oh, look at that. Mm. Anyway, yeah, I don't buy it unless you really, really want to try it. I wouldn't ever buy it again. They're mint shit. I know that. I don't like straight, so I haven't tried it straight. I don't even know if they make anything other than those three. But I wouldn't buy it at all. Like I, I said, I just reiterate, reiterated that like six times. So, little recap. It's dry. Tastes like shit. It's not worth the $2 and some change that I paid. Don't buy it. It's got a 3 out of 10 stars. And get yourself some Skull Cough Syrup Cherry before you get that shit. Anyway, y'all. Let me know in the comments what you want me to review next. Um... I'll go, if I have it in my area, I'll go buy it. If you haven't checked out my other videos, go check them out. Give this one a like or a dislike. Just, I don't care, whatever you want. Let me know what I'm doing wrong if you don't like the video and I'll change it. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Freaking, we've been building pretty quick this past nine days. I've gained like 25 subscribers now. So let's keep building the channel. Keep this community tight and, uh, you know, just keep doing what we're doing. Check out my other videos, and I'll catch y'all when I catch y'all. Till then, like I used to say, stay classy, and I'll catch you on the dip side.